Since June, a small restaurant in Toronto has been serving a selection of different indigenous foods from across Turtle Island. It's our culture, it's our history, it's our food is just as important as our languages. So, and a lot of communities in Canada and North America itself lost the ability, lost their language. And as sad as that is, we we lost part of our identity. And if we lose a little bit of our food identity, then we we're, we're losing ourselves. But one particular menu item is causing a cultural conflict for Cookham Kitchen, and that's seal meat. A petition demanding that the restaurant take seal meat off the menu has already received over 4,000 signatures. In a statement to APTN, petition author Jennifer Manho states, Cookham Kitchen may be an indigenous restaurant, but they are sourcing the seal meat from the commercial hunt. Mano says she started the petition because the company that provides the seal meat, CDNA, gets it from local Magdalene Island hunters in the Gulf of St. Lawrence, not indigenous hunters. CDNA says that they follow strict regulations from the Department of Fisheries and Oceans. Getting beef or chicken or pork is, they're raised in a lot worse conditions than uh, a seal. A seal is out in the wild and it eats what it naturally eats. It's not eating corn, it's not eating any antibiotics, or it's not giving it any hormones. So this is as natural as meat comes. And it's just, it's part of our culture. It's part of our identity. Shawana says he worked for weeks to find a suitable supplier. And now, a counter petition has been started to keep seal meat on the menu. And to educate Manhouse about anti-indigenous behavior and colonialism. Alan Kuchi of Nipissing First Nation started the Pro Eat Seal petition. It's important that we support Indigenous owned businesses and restaurants in particular. Um, it's such a great way to share the culture, to share the food, to, um, you know, with everybody. Kuchi is concerned about how animal rights activists are targeting Cookham Kitchen. So they're actively trying to target the restaurant to bring it down and um, slander it. Right now, Coochie's petition is trailing Mano's petition by almost 500 signatures. Although the petition has gained support locally and internationally, it hasn't seemed to slow down Cookham's Kitchen. They will keep serving Seal. It's one of the restaurant's top sellers. We have to pay homage to our brothers and sisters up north, and what better way is to their main source of protein and is, is Seal. Beverly Andrews, APTN National News, Toronto.